Hello and welcome to All Top Fives. I previously discussed my top five strangest space objects, but now I'm looking more specifically at planets. Here are five of the most unusual planets known to modern science. Number five, J1407b. Starting off with a Goliath, J1407b sits towards the Centaurus constellation, about 420 light years away from us. What makes this planet special is its rings. Now, Saturn has impressive rings about 280,000 kilometers wide, but J1407b, a planet only 6% of the size of Saturn, has rings that are 120 million kilometers wide, more than 400 times bigger than those of Saturn. Lots of sources say 200 times bigger, but by my calculations, and feel free to check them, it's actually 400 times bigger. It's mind-boggling though, that ring system. That's getting on for the distance between Earth and the Sun. It would take six and a half minutes for light to travel from one edge of this planet's rings to the other edge, and all for a planet that's thought to be about the size of Mars, which is smaller than the Earth. Wow. Number four, Methuselah. Otherwise known by its less catchy scientific name, PSR B1620 26b, Methuselah is the oldest planet known to science. In fact, it's so extremely old that it breaks some models of how we think the universe actually formed. Methuselah orbits a pulsar, that's a spinning neutron star that spins at about 100 times per second, and it's estimated to be 12.7 billion years old. That's nearly three times older than the Earth, and only one billion years younger than the entire universe. Methuselah breaks certain rules of how we thought the universe worked. That's because when the universe was only a billion years old, it's been widely accepted that only gaseous objects could form, as there shouldn't have been enough heavy elements to make hard terrestrial planets. But Methuselah is definitely terrestrial, and at such an age, it's a mystery as to how it could have formed. Truly ancient, and its name suits its purpose. Number three. PSR J171914 b. Yep, there's no catchy name for this one, so I'm going to call it Sonic. The reason being because it's the planet with the fastest known orbit of its star in our universe. It orbits a pulsar so closely that the entire circle it makes around the star could fit inside our Sun. Because Sonic travels so rapidly around its star, it manages to complete an entire year in the space of 2 hours, 10 minutes and 37 seconds. So, in the time that it takes you to watch Die Hard or Return of the Jedi, Sonic has got one year older. To put it into perspective for you, if you were to live to a respectable age of 75 Earth years, then on this speedy planet, you could celebrate your 300,000th birthday and still have hundreds to spare absolutely mind-blowing. Sonic also broke another record when it was discovered in August 2011, when it was the densest known planet in the universe, with a density much higher even than Diamond. It's been surpassed since by even denser planets, but it's still noteworthy. Number 2. Tres 2b. 750 light years away from Earth is Tres 2b, otherwise known as Kepler 1b. It's like a hot Jupiter, hot because it's very close to its star, and Jupiter because it's a gas giant. What makes Tres 2b special, though, is that it's the darkest known planet in the universe. It actually reflects less than 1%, that's thought to only be 0.04% to be precise, of the light that hits it. That makes it appear darker than a piece of coal, or even black acrylic paint. If the numbers are correct, it reflects as much light as the recently man-made material Vanta Black, made out of carbon nanotubes, also claimed to absorb 99.96% of all the light that hits it. Why Tres 2b is so absorbent of light isn't fully known. Some scientists think it's because the planet is absent of reflective clouds, like those we have on Jupiter, which would reflect a lot of light. Others claim it could be down to the presence of chemicals in the atmosphere that can absorb light, such as vaporized sodium, potassium, or gaseous titanium oxide. Whatever the reason, it's still an amazing feature. Number 1. Korot 7b. 
If hell was a planet, it would be Korot 7b. It was the first planet to spawn the term lava ocean planet, and with good reason. Its maximum temperature is thought to reach 2,600 degrees Celsius, that's 4,700 Fahrenheit. And, as such, scientists believe it's covered in an ocean of lava. It even once held the title for shortest year at 20.5 hours, until Sonic was discovered, as I mentioned earlier. Its close proximity to the star it orbits is responsible for its hot, volcanic, Hades-like environment. To add to the hellishness of Korot 7b, it is thought to have a very low pressure atmosphere. Because of its makeup and temperature, instead of having weather systems with water raining on the landscape, scientists theorized that rock would vaporize, rise in clouds, and then rain back down again as particles of magnesium, silicon, iron, and so on. Basically, it rains metal and rock. <laughs> if that's not hellish, I don't know what is. And that's it from all top fives for this week. All these planets have been discovered within a small, local section of our galaxy alone. Imagine how many more of these records would be broken, or laws of physics would be bent, if we could look further afield in our galaxy, or even in the other billions of galaxies in our universe. Oh, it's mind-boggling, and I bet there's some unimaginable stuff out there. Let me know what you thought of these five in the comments, I'd be interested to hear what you think. And of course, if you've enjoyed this video, please do give it the thumbs up on YouTube, because it really does help me out. If you enjoyed this one and would like to see more, you can subscribe for a new video every single Tuesday on loads of different topics. Peace and love to each and every one of you, and I'll see you all next time on All Top Fives.